Wiltshire has made history today by blasting into space to dock with the International Space Station. Yes, Tim Peake, who also used to work as a helicopter test pilot for Augusta Westland in Somerset, has been training for years for the moment of a lifetime, which was witnessed by millions across the world when he blasted off from Kazakhstan at exactly three minutes past 11 this morning. Well, in the last hour, we can tell you that Mr. Peake and his crew uh, have successfully docked with the space station. Our correspondent, Ken Goodwin, was with school children in Gloucestershire to witness a truly historic day. There can't be many kids who can say, my godfather's an astronaut. But here's one. Tim Peake's godson, Will, watched today's launch live with his classmates at King Stanley Primary School near Stroud. Um, what do you think he's feeling now, getting ready to go? A bit, um, worried. It might, it might go a bit wrong, maybe. The countdown begins. and Timothy Peake on their way to the International Space Station. It's an exciting but nervous moment for Will as he watches the Soyuz rocket quickly accelerate. He's probably pinned back to his seat. Why would he be pinned back to his seat? He's going very fast, so he'll be pinned back to his seat. But it's going like about 10,000 miles an hour or something. Will's mother says she's been keeping in touch with Tim and his wife right up to the launch. We've had regular photographs every few minutes almost, and I had a, a message from her about five minutes before launch. Um, so it's been wonderful because whilst we would love to be there, um, we do feel like we're sharing it because we've had photographs and, and feelings, and obviously the feelings are, are running quite high. And how excited is your son Will about all of this? He has been beyond his excitement. Um, up very early this morning, every day we've had countdown to when launches. So, yeah, he, he is very proud, a very proud godson. Some of Will's classmates say they might be tempted into space so long as they can take their favourite foods. What would you like to eat? Uh, chocolate. Oh, oh the, the pupils have been really inspired. Will's been talking about uh, the launch and his uh, links, obviously, to Tim Peake for about two years now. So we've been slowly counting down to this point. Uh, we've done various space days already. After Christmas, we're uh, doing a whole space week for the whole school. And hopefully over the next six months, we can do some links up uh, with Tim Peake to actually in space. We believe we might even be able to email him. It's been an exciting day, not just for the country. Tim Peake is the first British person who's been into space for more than two decades, but also for Will and his classmates, who are hoping that when Tim comes back to Earth, he'll pay them a visit. Ken Goodwin, ITV News, King Stanley. I love what they were saying about food. Yeah. <laughs> Why did he I know, it wouldn't surprise me, though, if they got a branch up there no. somewhere. Um, so